My name is George Gopadi and I have a profound hearing loss. Uh, it started at about ages of 8 and 10 as a result of malaria. About 2003, I had cochlear implant because at that level, at that point I had profound hearing loss and uh, that was the only way to get my hearing back up. And I discovered after the uh, surgery that my residual hearing in that year was all gone as a result of surgery. That happens to all, almost all people who get cochlear implants. So I started asking around and I was referred to handy dogs. And I knew nothing about dogs at that point in time. We had cats for 35 years, 40 years. And my wife was a cat person. She hated dogs. She didn't want dogs. She didn't want anything to do with dogs. But I said, that is the only way. A cat is not going to wake me up at night. <laughs> so if somebody calls my name, he'll alert me and take me to that person. This is one of the most important things because I work with a lot of people. And people call, I don't hear. I, I hear but don't understand. But if they call me, George, he will alert me and I say, show me and he will take me to that person who called and he sits there. Hey, George, is that you? Show me. Robert, show me. Show me. George, good <laughs> <to see> <laughs> He's with me everywhere, 24 hours a day, travels with me, but here he's more like your child. And that happens because of the way uh, handy dog model is to have you train your own dog rather than somebody else training and giving it to you. So during the training process, you create the bond. When you ask him to do something, he knows that he's working. But otherwise, with you at home, for example, he's your pet and he's uh, best friend to have.